What is going on guys evolution here and we are back with some more of the grand tour series on the island map hopefully you guys are having a great day so this episode we're going to be heading out we're going to be taming up our chibi and uh getting that whole thing going and then go kill some alphas i want to do a little bit of leveling on the chibi and then we're going to potentially do some other things we'll have to see so at the time of recording this the argentavis has the most upvotes that's what you guys wanted to see there was another one that had the same amount of upvotes, but there was two creatures on there. So I don't really know what to do with that. Maybe we'll tame up those creatures and chipify them down the road. Uh, but the Argentavis solo has the most votes. So uh, we're going to head out. We're going to find just any level Argentavis, tame it up, and uh, make it a chibi. So yeah, we're going to head towards the volcano here and hopefully find one with cool colors. I don't actually know if it keeps the colors of the actual RGU tame or if it's just random. I guess we'll find out. I bet you we're going to see a lot of level 6s, which will be uh, quite normal at this point. We already got an RG here. Ooh, I do like the, uh, the black and white. We might go for that one, assuming it's not a super level. 18. We got another one over there, far away. 30, okay. And what level are you? You're going to be 6. Yes, you are. Okay, we're going to go for this one. Because I do really like the colors on that. I think it looks great. I just want to kind of lead it away from this area. It's a bit scary. Alright, so let's go ahead and place down the trap. Like so. And I walk through... Any of these? I can. Okay, I can walk through the last one, which is all we really need. So let's do that. Alright, so let's go ahead and see if we can get this RG without too much, uh, oh. It's dead. Okay, well that kind of sucks. I liked the colors on that. Alright, so I found another one with colors that I like. It's a 24 male. I'm a big fan of how it's looking, so let's go ahead and throw down the pen again. Alright, let's try and get this. Bring it in. And it didn't come in. Oh, come on. Alright, you know what? I might actually just go for the trank like this. Just straight up tranking it. Unless we just miss every arrow. Okay, there we go. And it's out. Don't even need a trap. It's such a low level. Let's go ahead and throw in the prime. And then uh, we're going to wait for this thing to pop up. All right. So the RG is up. So if we go ahead and pull out the S plus gun. We can go Dino Chibify. And let's just take a good long look at the colors here. So we can uh, see if it's actually the same or if it's just a random chibi. Nice long look. Okay, I think we're ready. So, now we just click. And we got a chibi. Just like so. Let's throw it on. Oh, it's green? So we just get a random chibi, it looks like, which is kind of crazy. And look at our little chibi. It's amazing. It's actually amazing. What is that head on there? I have no idea. Head, please. Don't be so weird. And it's like back feathers are super long. It's a very strange looking creature. Definitely looks cool though. All right, so the colors on the chibi seem to be random because we did not have green on the original RG there. So what I want to do is actually tame up a bunch more RGs and then we could potentially get a super cool looking chibi. So, let's go ahead and just shoot you in the face. Like, look at our chibi. It's so amazing. And let's just do that. You can shoot me all you want. Not really a big deal. And you're out. Alright, so I've got a couple more RGs here. So let's take a look at these colors and see if it's actually random. Or if that was just like some weird color region thing. Because we got that one. We got that one. So let's go ahead and chipify them. Dino. We gotta be very careful we don't get our actual RG. That would be so sad. Okay, so we got another chibi. And let's chibi you as well. 
So there is one of the new ones we got. I do actually like that quite a bit. And then we have this one. Which looks very strange. A little bit of blue in the uh, the top there. And then like some purple on the tail. Kind of kind of looks naked. I don't really like that one. And then we also have this one, or is this the one we just looked at? That's the one we just looked at. We need to grab this one. And this is our original. So, so far, I am liking this one the best. But let's, uh, let's tame a couple more, see if we can get something even fancier. Okay, so we've been taming up a bunch of Argentavis here. We have three more chibis to check out, and I actually grabbed a drop, and we picked up an Apprentice Stego Saddle, which is pretty decent. It's not bad. I'll take it. And then a Ramshackle Paraceratherium Saddle, which is, eh, it is what it is. So let's check these out. Uh, let's K-mode. Let's get to the right position. There we go. So we've got our first new one here. Okay, I don't, I don't know how I feel about that one. That one seems kind of ugly to me. So let's move on. And you should go up there. I think that's the the old one. What about you? How are you looking? Oh, I do like that. There's some strong blue on the top of that one. But the colors in general are not bad. And then we have... One more to check out. Oh. That one looks kind of cool. A bit on the darker side, but not bad. So I think we're going to stick with this one. I like it the best out of all the ones we have. So if you guys have a name for it, let me know in the comments below and we will name this Chibi next episode. And I think I found a new addiction. Just uh, taming creatures to see if we get a fancy Chibi. I don't know. It uh, may replace the railing addiction. We'll have to see. But I'm happy we've got a new chibi, so we're going to head back to base here. And uh, I want to go out and find some alphas. And I know I didn't ask for any name suggestions for the bear, but one of you guys wanted me to name it Winnie, so we've done that. So, uh, yeah, we're going to take this thing out. We're going to hopefully find some alphas and ruin their day. All right, so I'm heading back to where our starter base was because there were so many alpha raptors in this area. And I'm hoping to find more. We just need to cross the uh, water here. There's a Dinosuchus in the water. Kind of terrifying. Are you a super amazing level? I would love to tame up a good level. No, you're not. Okay. We'll just have to fight you then. Because you ain't so tough. Although your bleed hurts a bit. Not that much. But just a little bit. And there's an Alpha right in front of us. Okay, here we go. It starts. We destroy everything. And everything. Wow, that is... I do no damage to the Fiomia? Is that a joke? Is that literally a joke? I thought we would definitely do some damage to the Fiomia. Okay, there's a ton of raptors here. Let's just deal with everything in the area. Except for maybe the... There's Zeno because he can kill me off my mount, and that's not really what I'm about. Let's grab some Stam. Okay, you guys, listen, I'm getting ready to fight a Alpha Raptor. I can't have any of this. Everything's buffed because of the Alpha Raptor. Can we just not deal with any of that? Okay. I think we're ready. Wait. Now we're ready. We got a wave at it. Just a little wave. Oh, the animation is fixed. Last time it was uh, struggling a bit. Oh, we can just paw at you? Oh, this is going to be easy. You have no chance. Are you getting a little bit closer? Okay. You have a little bit of a chance. Just because you were in the water there for a bit. Okay, this is kind of a high level. Oh, no, it's not. It's only a 66. It feels like a high level. It feels really tanky. But we've got this in the bag. Not really a big deal. 
Why did we just do that? Not sure. Did we just kill you? There we go. That took about half of our health, which is not bad. There we go. One alpha down. Uh, so we didn't get a super amount of experience from that. But it's a start. Alright, we got another Alpha Raptor on us. Well, let's just deal with this. We do way more damage now. And everything else is coming at us. I don't really want to mess with the Titan Manera. Oh, now we have Maganera. Oh, this Raptor's dead. Oh, we spotted another Alpha Raptor. Let's go ahead and fight you, and I guess this trike as well at the same time. Guess that's not the worst thing in the world. Are you strong? I don't think you're that strong. We should be fine in this fight. Actually seems weaker than the last one we fought. I don't like that it goes to the side of my body. Oh, come on. Just keep... There we go. Keep hitting it. Don't ever stop hitting it. All right, let's see if we can find maybe one more Alpha Raptor. And then I kind of want to find an Alpha Carno. Because these have not really been much of a challenge. It looks like there's one up there. There are so many Alpha Raptors in this area. This is the Alpha Raptor zone. That's exactly what this is. And I'm hoping this one isn't a super high level. Are you kind of crazy? You're 84. Okay. You know what? That's fine. That's doable. Just kill you. Oh, we do 300 damage now? Okay, that's what I like to see. That's like a good, solid number. I don't think I want to pump any more melee. Because that number just looks so cool on screen. And this thing's kicking our butt a bit. Oh, it's getting bloody. We're fine. Absolutely fine. Nothing to worry about. And it's dead. Okay, there we go. Doing work. Um, so I was just walking by the beach here, and I never noticed this in the cliffside before. But apparently, there is an explorer note right here. So let's go ahead and grab that, and I believe that gives us quadruple experience. Which is super amazing. So now we really need to find some alphas or something. Because we're going to get all the levels. And uh, we need to kill, I guess, everything. Might as well kill these Brontos. We're just going to attack, attack, and attack. We have plenty of time, so it's no rush. Let's just kill this Bronto. All the experience. And you're dead? There we go. Oh, a raptor? Thank you. Thank you for attacking me. You've given me experience. Another Bronto. Let's kill you as well. Oh, man. We hit so hard. Oh, that's so satisfying. Another Bronto. Might as well add it to the list. I kind of wish these were a bit higher level. We're just finding 12s and 24s so far. A couple more hits on you. You're dead. Are you... Another 24. Okay. So 12, 24, 12, 24. Very interesting. I guess that's all that there is. And that was probably pretty decent experience. Oh, we found another Alpha Raptor. We still have the experience, which is super amazing. So let's just kill you. Uh, you're a little bit stronger than the other ones I've faced. But I think we can deal with you. With our 300 damage. We should be fine. Are you bloody yet? I can't quite tell. It's a little bit dark here. Oh, you're definitely bloody. You are dead. Did I just get an Ascendant Hide shirt? Oh my goodness, it's the best shirt ever. It's just absolutely amazing. 
All right, we are back at the base here. Winnie did absolutely amazing. Destroyed so many things. We're actually at 6k health now, so we're looking pretty dang good. And uh, we killed a couple extra alphas. They were super low level, just alpha raptors, nothing too special. But I'm actually putting together a care package for Syntax. So, so far we have a Apprentice Metal Pick, an Apprentice Metal Hatchet, an Ascendant Hide Shirt, because why not? and uh, a journeyman crossbow so nothing super duper amazing uh but some decent stuff i hope he doesn't have anything better than this at the moment i don't think he does i'm not actually sure what episode he's on um but yeah we're gonna send that over we just need to make a box and then we have to find his base which is probably gonna be a bit of a challenge or i might just go uh check one of his videos real quick and see where he's located all right, we have the box, we have the sign, and I'm just trying to think, is there anything else I want to put in the care package? Um, do we have anything super special? Oh, you know what we could do? We could give him some cementing paste, because we have a ton. So maybe we do something like this, leave 2,500 in there, and then I believe we have some more in here. And then let's just bring a little bit of that back. Let's give him 1,000. I feel like 1,000 cementing paste is... Pretty, uh, pretty decent. I'm not even sure what he's going to do with cementing paste. I'm not even sure where he's at. Oh, no, we need to send one cementing paste there. Okay, there we go. An even thousand. Let's throw this all on the bird, and, uh, let's find out where he lives. All right, so we're at Syntax Base here, and, uh, I have no idea what I'm allowed to show. So we're just going to stare at the cliff. We're going to place this down right here and show absolutely nothing, because I don't want to be that guy. And we can go ahead and throw you down like that. Oh, but here's the here's where things get tricky. What do we send to Syntax? What do we put on the sign? Oh, I know. This is gonna be genius. Big fan. There you go. And we're very excited about it. Big fan. <laughs> Big fan. Ah, oh, that's perfect. And we go ahead and throw all this in here. I think that's looking pretty dang good. And uh, yeah, we're going to head back to the base. And you know what, guys? I think that's actually going to be it for this video. So remember to smash that like button. And remember to subscribe if you guys have not already. Because it seriously helps me out. And uh, don't forget that I need a name for this chibi. It's looking absolutely amazing. I'm a big fan of the Argentavis. And yeah. Have a good one. See ya.